you guys remember? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> it rolled. Fight it. Do you remember that I have a wife? Is that what you're gonna say? No, no, no. no. It's okay. Yeah, no. you don't need to be nervous. Yeah. You guys remember Down Under Greg, right? From Bush Boy Knives, the guy who made me film that intro with no pants. Fine, it's not that he told me to film it with no pants, he just said, if you want to unbox it off camera, I think you should enjoy it. And I thought, well, if I'm gonna enjoy it, I gotta enjoy it with no pants and whiskey. Well, this time, he sent us a package and he has another demand. He says, you gotta film it with Becca. First time he says no pants, second time he says with Becca, he sounds like a pretty cool guy. One heck of a crazy Australian. He's not crazy, but he is Australian. So anyhow, this is Becca. You've seen her in some past videos such as Uchigomo no Hana Takamura head to head with a... Didn't you use the smallest of our petties? That might have been... Use Baby K? Baby K versus Pomelo. She's been in a few videos. Of course, um, the video with Kino, our, our son, who's quietly sleeping outside of the studio. Greg also said, can you do the video with Kino? But I told him he is a part of the family, but he is not... Not to be trusted around knives. Yeah, nor is he obedient. Uh, speaking of Greg, before we open this package, and we'll get to it very quickly, again, if you haven't checked him out, please check him out. He is the owner and knife smith behind Bush Boy Knives in Australia. He sent us this knife about a year ago, almost exactly a year ago. This is a 260 millimeter Damascus single bevel Kiritsuke. So let's see what he sent us this time. Then I'm going to the Kiradashi, going to the knife hole. It's so cute. You like it? Mm -hmm. Which way should we open? You decide. I decide. Oh my god. I gotta get that ASMR. Don't block Becca. Becca is important because Greg has decided that you are to be important. I don't know if he wants you to commentate. Who knows? This is Frankie opening a tube. E exactly. I think he sent us a tube last time too, if I'm not mistaken. I mean, what I do like is his, his demands are, are reasonable and they're fun. You know, last time he said, uh, I want you to enjoy this, and I turned into a, a bit of a show, a bit of a, a bit of a drama king sometimes. And now he's like, open it with Becca, why not? That almost looks like my writing. Maybe I send this to myself. And we'll see, if Kino makes a guest appearance, all the better. This is a very sharp Kiradashi. It's my latest Kiradashi, I wanted an Instagram contest in December of 2023 by Chris Mead, a knife smith from Ireland. So we're using an Irish knife to open an Australian tube. Oh my. No, wait, did he make this a Saya again? This guy. Oh, new stickers? Hold on, there's, wait, is there more? Tube hand. Idiot. Oh, what the heck is this? This is a confusing piece of air-wrapped thing. Follow Frankie on Instagram to find out. Slash, open it now. Or actually, stop watching, go to Instagram, and, and you'll see what this is. What type of cowboy? What? <laughs> it's a pouch. It's a little pouch. This guy's crazy. You know what? I take it back. He's a crazy Australian. What is this? Holy dude. Come on. He sent us a Damascus dog tag. What? How amazing is that? So beautiful. You guys can see that. That's what the B roll was for. Gotta hide back his face too because the camera's like. Becca, get behind me. Excellent. Greg, you're starting strong. 
I expected a knife, not... I say Damascus. No, no, it's Damascus. Are we going to be able to put this on him, or is this going to be more of a souvenir? We can try putting it on, we can put it on his crate. We'll find a place. A new type of sticker, and I like this one because it's a, more of a decal. All right. I mean, I'm good. You guys good? That was the end of the unboxing. Oh, no way. Is that a shirt? Um, yeah, the duties said there was a shirt and kitchen knives. Apparently, and, and this is a man, I believe, who hunts and fishes. And so if he hunts and fishes, he must be a big fan, like my buddy Rob Clooney's, of vacuum sealers, because he vacuum sealed the t-shirts. <laughs> That's so awesome. You know, there's nothing quite like opening a vacuum sealed um, package. This is beautiful. I feel like this is a newish logo from him. Oh my god. The best part right here. Australian cotton. It's very hard to see. Here's the new logo. I'm gonna call it new. Greg, let me know if it's new. If it's not new, I'll put it on the video. This was not new. I'm crazy. Beautiful t-shirt. Or on the ladies. Ta -da! Or on the ladies of the back. Ta -da! Beautiful. Very, very nice. Thank you so much, man. Hell yeah. That's awesome. That is a big knife. Why, why, why is it so fat right here? I almost want to use the old knife to relax. Oh, shit. No way. What? He sent two knives. Becca, this one's yours. Uh, actually, yours. That's why you're unboxing. Yes, he told oh, me. Oh, really? Yes. Hey, thank you. It's I don't know what the thing is. Length. In the past, I know we talked about it. I told him you like smaller knives. I really like it. 165-ish centopus. Um, here, hey. have fun. So... I'm not sure what's been up over the past six months. It's been really strange. Things have happened in twos. In December, I had two videos in a row about Sayas. Never made one video about Sayas, two in a row. Then we did two videos about kitchen knife solutions, store solutions. Um, then we did a video about my mom receiving a knife and now my wife receiving a knife. So, you know, I'm, I'm not complaining. I'm a dude who receives free tools pretty often to do reviews on. Um, and now people are not only gifting me with knives, but the ladies, the special ladies in my life. Thank you so much. What do you this think? This a really cool fire. Right? You first. Oh yeah, the BBK, Bush Boy Ooh. Knives. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's really cool. So, Aww. oh, that's no way. <laughs> Is this how you do it? Uh, yeah, you, you gotta hide your eyes, because it looks for eyes. And then, and then you can look at that side screen and I'll take some B-roll of it later. <laughs> Did that kind of work? I don't know, Maybe? tell me, okay. yeah, we'll tell me in post-processing. Yeah, I'll tell you in post-processing slash on the screen. So? That's awesome. Can I see? No. Thank that, you, that's Greg. That's a cool end. What did you call? I said, thank you, Greg. I didn't call it anything. I thought you called him Craig. Craig, no, oh, I didn't boy. call him Craig. She got your name wrong, bro. No, I know who you are. That's, I love it. That's very it's a great cool. length. I like right? the curve to it. Yeah. Yeah, the purple oblique spacer is very, very cool. Nice and matte, and I'm just gonna go ahead and call this like a bubble gum colored feral. Cotton candy. Ooh, cotton candy, yeah, yeah. Let's try this again. There you go. You see I'm hiding your face? Oh my God. Beautiful. All right, what do you say you take your knife and open this? Oh my, did you save me like a mega Nakiri? Here, no, you That's open it. That's crazy. Uh, I haven't, don't have a good track record with knives. This That's one. true. You've chipped quite a few knives this month. I don't deserve it. How awesome is the vacuum seal? It's fine. I made a comment in the video when he sent this knife. I said, uh, you just made a knife that you sent to an Italian who is very used to opening cold cuts, salamis, prosciuttos, and vacuum sealed products. I'm like, immediately, you, you've won my heart. I'm like, this is gonna be awesome. All right, so you have what looks like <laughs> roughly a 165. Oh my God. This guy stepped it up in a year. Look at this. Just the handle. The handle is really nice. awesome. The like contour. 
Super cool. How the heck? This is almost like wet. It's probably just uh, conditioned. It ties. Yeah. That is a very cool saya. Oh, it ties, ties. Yeah, yeah. I thought it like just wrapped around. All right. And he sent me. Uh, let's see. Estimate, estimating, estimating. 240, 240, 240. Yeah, 230. He sent me <laughs> an awesome. No, wait. That's not even in the key. Or is what would I call this? This thing is nuts. I don't know, but that thing's cool. Right? This looks like a, a chopper, like a, a rocking chopper. I feel like we just cut lettuce for some kefta kebabs that we're having for dinner after this video. Well, by the time you watch it, it's long gone. <laughs> um, but yeah, I feel like this is what I would have used to slice and dice, well, slice more the hell out of that lettuce, shred it. Super, super cool. Um, so yeah, up on screen, you'll have the specs on what Dan under Greg sent us because of course I can only make some very, very loose conclusions. Um, thank you so much. He sent us, I mean, his shapes are very unique. I don't know what to call these things. Let me know in the comments below what you would call them. He sent this <laughs> of a shape. I mean, it reminds me of a few things, but it's still very unique. This and that. Likely 165, it's likely smaller than 165. Smaller than 165. Okay, so I think it's the same. Is it 120? Yeah, yeah. check with the Maburoshi. That's a 165. Oh, it is a 165. Yeah, boom. 165, that, uh, roughly 230, 240. This, down under Greg, Greg Bush Boy Knives. Check him out. He's a cool dude. He's easy to talk to. Um, always a joy. One of those lighthearted people that just finds the joy in life. He requested that she open the package. She didn't know why. You got a knife. I got a knife. I just followed instructions. Kino got a tag. We got a shirt. We got a sticker. You're the best. Hold it all up. Oh, these look like skis. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you like when Becca joins us on these videos every once in a while. I definitely need a haircut. I'm falling flat. I'm with a sexy lady and I'm, I'm looking like, Who a, also needs a haircut? like a loser. She is getting a haircut tomorrow. But by the time you watch this video, just like my calf does, long gone. Anyhow, thanks for watching and see you next time. Very cool. Ta -da, more surprises. Two videos in a row. Everyone wants my ladies in my life. A few moments later. First impressions? Uh, really nice. Someone's been working on his sharpening skills. Yeah, this is really nice. Yeah, even the way I see it from here. I like the curve to it. How about the length? Um, I mean, I really, really like the length because yeah. I like shorter knives. It probably can handle anything much bigger than this, though. Like, just practicality-wise. Then an onion, you mean? I mean, that's like a quarter of an onion. I'll try it on that one after. And you broke it down quite quickly. Hmm? You yeah. broke that down quite quickly. Everyone can critique my skills. I'll leave this for now. Okay. Move over. Mm. Damn, it looks nice with the gimbal. You guys, you see that ring? She's married, she's mine. Fuck her off. I don't think anyone wants these knife cutting skills. But they want what's above it. Hmm. What else can we get? Oh, damn. No fair, your angles are better than my angles. Your own personal videographer. I mean, I can film if you want. It honestly, seems to be cutting really well. It cuts very well. If you want to do the last garlic? No. You should cut. Thank you. Thank you.
Okay, buddy.